Hello guys, welcome to another video. Um, today is a review because I haven't done a review in a in a uh, short while. So um, today we're obviously reviewing something by Hornby. Um, one of the nicest models, I think. It's not a locomotive; it is a wagon, as you would have seen by the title. Um, it is a very nice wagon. Um, if I zoom out, it is. Their Great Western horse box, which I acquired at Railex last year. Um, I asked if you guys wanted to review it, no one got back to me, so I thought, yeah, I'll do one anyway. Um, now, this was about $35, so about 17 ish pounds um, over in your UK currency. Um, hang on, just move the camera. Ooh. And so it was reasonably cheap. Um, got it brand new, um, as you can see by the packaging, and it's in Great Western livery, um, in the brown and cream letter. Well, is it cream? Yeah, it's sort of cream lettering. Um, yeah, so it's a re, it's an amazing model, actually. If I um, it's a really nice. You can probably just see the glare, but yeah. Ah. Uh, it's Hornby product code is R6562, uh, Great Western Horse Box, and its number is 516. So this is the newer style of Hornby packaging, and I, I re it's similar to the uh, later Buckman stuff. It's very nice, so you just get it. And I'll take that off the layout. Um, and it's here, yeah, it's literally just you pop open the tab, and... Uh, and you just take out the model. Comes with a bit of plastic in there just to keep it safe. So that's very nice packaging. And then you've got the wagon itself, which is, if I zoom out a bit, a stunning wagon in terms of detail. It's very nice. I will be weathering this eventually. It rolls beautifully. But let's start with the underframe detail. Oh. So we've got lovely axle detail there. The load of rivets. And um, wheel base 12-0. I don't I can't read that. 12-0, and then I really can't read the smaller print. Hmm. And I think that those are steps, yep, steps into the human compartment. Um, you yeah, can't read that either. Now the wheels are interesting, they're not spoked or anything. They're really nice and like you can barely hear them. Um, no, it's stunning. Moving up onto the bodywork. Lovely um, door detail there. And the little door grab irons and the sort of the planking now this is I'd say where the the horses because it's a horse box would have those doors would have folded down or gone across or something and the horses would have um, got out but um yeah so that's that's lovely detail exactly the same around the other side just the other way around so yeah now this is amazing look how fine that detail is and that's separately fitted Believe it or not, yep, I'm not lying. That is separately fitted detail. Not sure about this stuff. No, that's separately fitted too. The these um these here, oh, they're lovely. And look how fine the buffers are. That's really nice. It's got NEM couplings with a dovetail NEM pocket. And um, yeah, it's oh, it's really nice. Really nice. Ten. What does that stand for, guys? Anyone tell me? <sighs> no, I was I was blown away by this model. Really, um, the, yeah, they're really nice. So the coupling bends along. But no, it's a really stunning model, and I do recommend it to anyone um, modeling the Great Western or the BR Western region, because I think you can get them in. British Railways livery as well. 
But no, the underframe is stunning as well. Yeah. Easily replace these couplings with KDs or um hang on. Or these thingies. Let focus, focus, come on. But yeah, those things that I've got attached to my hawks with. Um, but no, and uh, you've got a hook on there too, so you could use three link chain coupling. But yeah, this is a stunning model, guys, and I do thoroughly recommend it to anyone modelling the uh, the region in question. Um, packaging, 9 out of 10, because it's basically Bachman stuff, so 9 out of 10. Detail, um, no. Uh, Oh, what the hell, 10 out of 10. <laughs> um, it is, it is stunning. It is really, really stunning. And running quality, well. Smooth as, guys. Goes over points beautifully. And if you... It looks so graceful. Ah. Now this is my only sort of decent van, like, um, locomotive van. My other vans are old Hornby and Triang ones. But yeah. Now I've also heard that this, um, this would have been coupled right up to the locomotive. I'm not sure about that. Um, but that's what people have told me in their reviews, so. Yeah, I think we'll call it a day here, guys. Another stunning model from Hornby, one of their better models um, in the recent in recent history. Um, but yeah, Hornby are just out of, or Bachman is out of Hornby's league. To be honest, the Bachman are just producing beautiful models. But when Hornby produce a good model, they really produce a good model, and I I'm sure you will agree that that is a stunning model, right there. So, thanks guys, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, like me on Facebook as Cruelty Road Model Railway, and as always guys, see you later.